Hey everyone, Zach at Arborjet headquarters. Uh, today I wanted to take you through unboxing a quick jet. So this is the new version of the quick jet with the updated inline check valve, which is also available for purchase and is totally retrofittable to your existing quick jet. So we'll take a look at that in a moment. So comes in a nice little bucket. Uh, once you take the lid off, you got some packing material. Uh, inside you will find one product bottle with a closed cap, a second product bottle so you don't have to refill. You can go out with two caps. This one has your bottle cap assembly on it, graduated cylinder, half a liter of clean jet, safety glasses, your funnel for filling, the tool kit, so you got your drill bits, your plug setter and needle clean out tools, the manual with a registration card and a bumper sticker. And then finally in this little black pouch you have your device, it's pre-assembled. Inside the black bag, the device comes in this protected kit. Uh, inside there you have your, uh, your connection kit, your needles, an Allen wrench, a rebuild kit, and then also you have a belt clip so you can hang your device on your belt while you're walking around. And then on a carabiner you have a bottle hook so you don't have to carry the bottle. You can just kind of clip it to yourself and be on your way. All right, so first thing is to actually finish assembling your kit. So take the pieces out of the bag. So you take a quick jet. The first piece is your lure fitting that threads into the quick jet nozzle. From there, you have your quarter inch push to connect that threads into the lure fitting. Hand tight is fine for both of those. And then you just take your needle, put in the push to connect, and now your device is set up. Next thing to notice is different from the original quick jet kits, we have a much more uh, beefier check valve. Uh, it's not a ball and spring valve like the old ones. Uh, this is much more like the check valves for your quick jet or the old air hydraulic regulator. So when you get going to want to inject, you have your cap, your bottle. I have a bottle pre-filled with some food coloring and water. This one I don't have to hold that. I'm going to stick it in my measuring cup. Undo the Velcro to release the tube. That is simply just a push to connect. You should push it up in there, ready to go. I'm going to take the cap, put it in the bottle with the water, thread that on. And at this point, uh, you can actually start to squeeze your handle and draw the product out. So you see the move in. It's three squeezes. By the fourth, I have product in there. It's not filling the chamber. So I'd want to shoot that back in to either the bottle or your graduated cylinder. And then from there, you now have a five milliliter shot ready to go. So that's your quick jet device. Uh, it's very simple to set up. Uh, if you got any questions, feel free to call us at the office or check with your tech manager and we can walk you through some steps. All right, thanks a lot.